Politics Now Jubilee aspirants in Nyeri County have received their eagerly awaited certificates. The certificates were issued at the Nyeri National Polytechnic Friday evening. The aspirants had come to the venue all day and received the certificates well past 5 p.m. 30 aspirants for the county assembly seats received their certificates. Other aspirants for the various posts had earlier received their certificates in Nairobi. Present at the venue in Nyeri was the Jubilee gubernatorial aspirant Dr. Wahome Gakuru and his running Mate Mutahi Kahiga. Penina Wanjiru, Secretary of County Elections Board, confirmed that clerks who had earlier protested this week over delayed payments during the nomination process have now been paid. I want to believe that the ABC has prepared enough to deliver a credible and fair, transparent election. And we would like to urge them because we have done our campaign that the chairman and his team. They are going to cooperate with the parties, like Jubilee and the other parties, and the government is going to offer them the need necessary uh, resources that they need so that they can deliver to the people of Kenya a credible and fair uh, general election. And at least for the, for the first time, this time round, we want to believe that the people of Kenya will get the best leaders they can ever have. For, uh, for, for, for a long, long time. Uh, from the preparation they are already doing, we have a total trust, trust in them. Uh, and we believe, from the example that the Jubilee Party has shown, the IBC has no other option. The Jubilee has no other option apart from holding a credible and free elections. There, is a many, there are many things that we can, we can quote right now from whatever the IBC is doing, from the verification of register, from the preparation they are doing, from the involvement of the stakeholders. We have a total trust that they are going to hold a free and credible elections. And here in Yeri, we support the IBC fully. I believe so far what we have seen from IBC indicates they shall hold a free and credible general election. And I'm 100% sure IEBC will hold a credible, free and fair election. So by 8th August, we'll have good leaders and the election will be free. Thank you very much.